All right, hello everybody, welcome back. So today I'm gonna to be showing you how to build a redstone uh, plane in Minecraft. So this can either be a, uh, a regular airline passenger jet or it can be a bomber plane, whichever you want. Um, and it's pretty, it's fairly simple to build actually. It, uh, I know that this little contraption up here makes it seem like kind of difficult to start up, but it, it's actually pretty, pretty easy, uh, to build once you figure it all out. It took me a bit to figure out how to make this. Um, but like once you have it all down about how to make it, it's, it's pretty easy as long as you don't like do anything to mess up or anything. So anyway, so first off, you're going to need slime blocks. Uh, you're going to need redstone dust, uh, for our contraption up here. Uh, you're going to need a repeater. Uh, you're going to need... Uh, pistons, sticky piston, and observers. So, um, <clears throat> first off, what we're going to do is um, you're going to need a big contraption to be able to start this because um, our, our design relies on three different, um, three different things to start moving. So, uh, the, the observer, uh, so there will be a redstone button at the uh, end of the video that we will use to start this, um, uh, this contraption. Um, so now, uh, with that out of the way, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go and uh, you're going to want it want to place uh, an observer like this. Uh, so you're going to get that out of the way there. So like place an observer like this. Um, and this is going to be the back of the plane right here. So then you're going to want to take a sticky piston. Um, make sure it's a sticky piston, by the way. It won't work if it's just a regular piston. Then you're going to place slime blocks on the uh, uh, right and left sides of it. Then we're going to build out here. And... Uh, we're going to place a piston right here. Uh, oh, wait, let's get rid of that piston real quick because we don't want the observer to activate. Um, so then place the piston right there. Make sure to get rid of the, uh, uh, the slime block before placing the piston, by the way. Um, you will regret it if you don't. Um, so anyways, then do the same thing over here. And with that, you have your first uh, basic design as to how to build this plane. Um, as we can see, uh, so this is what will make the plane start moving. So I could just theoretically put a block right in front of this observer and it would start moving. But we have more that we want to do with this. Um, so we're going to build uh, the tail um, and you can make this, you can make it one block higher if you uh, want. You can make it three blocks high like this. It's, it's all up to uh, preference really. Um, personally, I am going to go, I'm going to go with it being about this big. Uh, and then we're going to place two, some end rods on, uh, on it just to make it look good. Um, so that's that. Uh, then once you do that, you can go up here. So we're going to build up here like this. Um, and we're going to need to build two out. So what we're going to do here is we're going to place an observer like that. Then we're going to place a piston like that and we're going to get rid of that. Um, so let's place, uh, so basically just replicate the design uh, from over here, uh, right here. Uh, just make sure it's two blocks away um, from this design because otherwise with the way we have our contraption set up, the sticky block will get cut uh, on or uh, caught on this and it will screw up the whole design, uh, um, unfortunately. Even, it, uh, don't try going for a one block difference because I've already tried that multiple times and it didn't work. So, um, let's build out this way like that. Um, so, now you, wait, actually that's what we need right there. Now you need, uh, you need an observer. Then you need a sticky piston. Um, and make sure you have your pistons uh, on these two ends right here and then the sticky piston on just this single observer right here so make sure to repeat that for all of the designs we're doing uh, that's very important so then there you go um there's your second design and now what we'll do is we will build wings so uh it can be about three blocks out uh and then we're going to place um some end rods on it so this can simulate uh those little spike things that come out or like bullet holes um, that like planes shoot out of, um, since, uh, I'm building this to look like a bomber plane, um, just so you're aware rather than an airline plane. Um, and anyways, I will place this out. Uh, make sure your contraption doesn't like get stuck on the, the sticky blocks, by the way, that's, that's very bad. Um, not going to work out well. Now we can move out here and with this one, we can just build a single block down and boom like that. Um, and then we'll build a piston out like that, then like this, uh, ba repeat the same design again. Um, so do that, um, break that, then 
place your observer right there, place your sticky piston right there, and then place it like that. So with that, you have your bomber plane. So you could place um you could place your end rods out here like on these two ends right here, but that would I don't personally think that would look too great because um this uh is as we can see, um, this sticky block is going to uh, be what activates the observer and keeps it going. Um, so it's going to look, and it'll be sticking on it. So it'll look a little bit strange. Uh, you could add something like wheels somewhere on this plane. Um, let, let's just, uh, like theoretically, uh, it would be probably best to place it like right here along the sticky blocks. Um, then we could place it like right here, uh, just, just so it looks like that. Um, personally, I'm not a big fan of the, uh, of the black wheels. So we're just going to get rid of that real quick. Let's show you how to start this. So let's just make sure that everything's good here. Cause I've had multiple occasions where I screwed this up. So I'd rather not do that now. So make sure you have all your sticky blocks just prepared, um, to, to activate the pistons and all that. And by the way, once you activate the pistons, make sure you destroy this piston and the blocks right here. Cause otherwise, uh, it's going to get caught along the tail there and it will stop uh it will stop your plane from flying unfortunately so it's not something we really want and make sure your uh make sure your repeaters are pointing in the right direction by the way like i i screwed up the design earlier by not pointing them in the right uh direction so with that uh now go ahead and press your button and as we can see uh our our thing is moving there we go um there you go there is your uh there's your plane um I would add dispensers to it so like it could actually like drop TNT but the problem is like I, on Java edition at least I can do it on bedrock but um, on Java for some reason like I can't get a dispenser to stay uh, stuck to a sticky block and uh, or like be connected to an observer during the same time like my design on bedrock edition didn't work on Java for some reason so uh, this is for Java edition um, I assume it works on the other versions of Minecraft I haven't tried um, but it probably does. So this is this is pretty cool. You can even add your uh, you can even add your boat into uh, into the thing right here. Hey, uh, hey, uh, can I get in? All right, yeah. So you can add your boat and you can just go for the ride. As we can see, uh, a very laggy ride. Um, I would not recommend uh, taking this across uh, the uh, the um, Ender Dragon Island to all the end cities and all that. Um, and the reason for that is because eventually this thing has a tendency to malfunction. Um, just because, like, as you can see, like, the pistons are, like, working in a very specific way. And, like, sometimes one of them will get off beat. And once one of them gets off beat, it kind of screws everything up, unfortunately. Um, so, anyways, that's the plane. Let me go show you a second design that I made with this. Um, and this one's pretty easy to build, too. Um, actually easier, in my opinion. Um, so, again, you're going to need your little contraption to start this up here. Um... And this one is a fighter jet that I made. Um, it's kind of kind of a weird fighter jet, to be honest with you, um, because like it has these two, uh, it has these two um, uh, tails just sticking out. Most fire planes don't have it, but I think it looks kind of cool. Um, you could add a tail, you could add a big tail up here, and then just have it lo looking like that. Personally, I don't like it just because like this this thing is one block underneath the wings. Um, and I feel like if we were to do that, then, uh, if we were to build a tail on this little area right here, then these blocks would have to be equal with or above, uh, the wings. So let's get this thing started and, uh, or let me just show you real quick. Um, so it's pretty easy design. So basically you just take the design that I, I already showed you earlier. Uh, then you replicate it on each side. Um, and then you build the wings. Um, so pretty easy. Uh, make sure you have the observers and facing in the right direction, sticky pistons uh, and all that. Um, then with that, we can start our design. This one, you won't have to destroy any blocks, extra blocks for, which is good. Um, so as you can see, there you go. There is your plane. Uh, it's your fighter jet. Um, it looks pretty cool in my opinion. So that's how you, that's how you build a, uh, uh, bomber and fighter plane in Minecraft, everybody. I hope you all enjoyed. Um, this was uh, I spent a lot of time messing around with this design yesterday, trying to like expand upon it and make cool stuff. And I, I think I, I think I did a good job. Um, I hope you, I hope you think I did a good job too. And if you enjoyed, please leave a like, uh, subscribe for more and make sure to leave a comment. Uh, if you want me to make more redstone tutorials or just tutorials about anything in Minecraft in general, uh, please say so. Um, I do that all the time on this channel. 
And uh, I also make a lot of mod reviews on this channel too. So um, there's a lot of stuff for anybody to enjoy here. Um, and then uh, I will see you all uh, in the next Minecraft video. Goodbye.